square root of 98 plus square root of 18 upon square root of 98 minus square root of 18. How do we simplify this? So there are two methods that we can use to simplify. First method where we first simplify the radicals. So 98 we can write it as 49 times 2 under square root plus 18 as 9 times 2 under square root upon again 49 times 2 under square root minus 9 times 2 under square root. When 8 times b is under square root we can write it as square root of a times square root of b. So this will be square root of 49 times square root of 2 plus square root of 9 times square root of 2 upon square root of 49 times square root of 2 minus square root of 9 times square root of 2. Square root of 49 is 7 so 7 times square root of 2 plus square root of 9 is 3. 3 times square root of 2 upon square root of 49 again 7 times square root of 2 minus 3 times square root of 2. Now here we can take square root of 2 common and write 7 plus 3. 7 times square root of 2 divided by square root of 2 will give us 7. 3 times square root of 2 divided by square root of 2 equals to 3. Upon here also we can take square root of 2 common and write 7 minus 3. Now square root of 2 is a like factor so we can cancel. 7 plus 3 is 10. 7 minus 3 is 4. Now divide both numerator and denominator by 2. 2 times 2 is 4. 2 times 5 is 10. So answer is 5 upon 2. This is one method. In another method we can rationalize the denominator. To rationalize the denominator we divide and multiply by the conjugate of the denominator. So conjugate of square root of 98 minus square root of 18 will be square root of 98 plus square root of 18. So square root of 98 plus square root of 18 upon square root of 98 minus square root of 18 multiply and divide by square root of 98 plus square root of 18 upon square root of 98 plus square root of 18. Now if square root of 98 is a and square root of 18 is b then in the numerator we have a plus b times a plus b or this is equal to a plus b whole square and the in denominator we have a minus b times a plus b. So it is equal to differences of square. We can write it as a square minus b square. So it will be square root of 98 plus square root of 18 whole square upon square root of 98 square minus square root of 18 square a plus b whole square. It is equal to a square plus b square plus 2ab. So it will be square root of 98 square plus square root of 18 square plus 2 times square root of 98 times square root of 18 upon we can remove the square root with this square. So it is 98 minus 18 again remove the square root with this square. So 98 plus 18 plus 2 this we can write 98 times 18 under square root upon 80. 98 plus 18 is 116 plus 2. 98 we can write 49 times 2 and 18 is 9 times 2 upon 80 or 116 plus 2. So we can write square root of 49 times square root of 2 square times square root of 9 upon 80 or 116 plus 2 square root of 49 is 7 then times 2 then times 3 upon 80 or 116 plus 84 upon 80 now add 200 upon 80 cancel this 0 and this 0 2 times 4 is 8 and 2 times 10 is 20 2 times 5 is 10 and 2 times 2 is 4. So answer is 5 upon 2. Same answer that we got in the first method. So it is equal to 5 upon 2.
Which method did you like more? Let me know in the comment section. Thanks for watching.